Lancome Advanced Genifique is a world-renowned skincare product and probably one of the most well-known serums alongside Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair. And I had no idea Lancome were even in the process of relaunching an upgraded Genifique serum. I just randomly saw marketing of it pop up on the Australian website a couple weeks ago. For some reason, they did a relatively soft launch in some markets around the world. And at the time of filming, I don't even think this has been announced in the US yet. And just to confirm, this video is not sponsored. I bought this serum myself just because I was super curious to try it. I wouldn't say that I'm like the biggest Lancome fan overall but Genifique is a flagship product and it's a product that has piqued my interest for several years over the years. I last finished a bottle of the previous or like current formula advanced Genifique towards the end of last year so I've actually had it in my routine pretty recently. Before I get into some info comparing advanced Genifique to the new Genifique Ultimate let me just rewind a little bit and just discuss the concept of Lancome Genifique overall. So what is Lancome Genifique? Put simply, Genifique has been designed with the skin microbiome in mind. The flagship serum Advanced Genifique has been around for many, many years and it was last updated in 2019. That is up until this new Genifique Ultimate came out just this month. Lancome's research in, in collaboration with scientists from several institutions have explored and essentially mapped out the fluctuations of our skin's microbiome. Their research shows that our microbiome naturally changes as we age on top of changes resulting from lifestyle and the environment. For example, women living in highly polluted areas that exhibit premature signs of aging have modified microbiomes more similar to those of older women. Advanced Genifique was tested monitoring differences in bacterial diversity and bacterial quantity. And after exposing the skin to an aggressor, their test showed that skin recovered faster after the application of Genifique serum. To achieve this like repair mechanism, Lancome Genifique uses three prebiotic and four probiotic fractions. And these are mostly derived through biofermentation. This means that Genifique releases sugars, amino acids, and certain lipids into the skin, basically creating an environment for skin to be able to repair in its best state. What's new in Genifique Ultimate? The DNA of Genifique still remains the same in the new serum. I'm unsure if Lancome is planning to keep both of them, but I suspect they will phase out Advanced Genifique and focus on Genifique Ultimate moving forward. The new formula of Genifique Ultimate still contains the seven prebiotic and probiotic fractions, and also the kind of signature bifida ferment lysate. Plus, both serums tout hyaluronic acid. It's just that the new Genifique Ultimate, they specify that they're using a high molecular weight hyaluronic acid. I guess this specifically allows for a little bit more of a surface feeling of hydration. With all that said, the big calling card of the new serum are the two new feature extracts. They've added a beta glucan extract and a licorice extract. These two new extracts kind of shift the purpose of the serum or enhance the purpose of the serum to include a kind of wider range of repair mechanisms. And I think it more intently focuses this, this product on actually soothing and calming the skin. They've also added a root juice to the formula that they don't really call out in marketing, but it's known to have really good prebiotic effect in the skin and has a reputation of being helpful for helping the skin combat skin stresses too, which very much fits with the story of the updated serum. The previous Genifique contained a vitamin C derivative called ascorbyl glucoside. This vitamin C is not included in the new serum, so they're focusing more on the beta glucan and licorice instead. While Genifique has always been known as a skin repair serum, it seems like they're really honing in on this, um, specifically in the new Genifique Ultimate. A lot of the phrasing is talking about repair science, I think a little bit more heavily than the prior serum did. The vibe that I got was the older serum spoke a lot more about microbiome and that has shifted more to repair, repair, repair specifically. The new serum actually reads incredibly beautifully and I was personally instantly attracted to it by the addition of beta glucan and licorice. I consider these ingredients to be super functional and I'm happy to see them included in such a flagship serum. The previous Genifique formula was nice, but to me, 
it was ultimately a hydrating serum. I never felt that it actually helped my skin with visible repair very much, but the updates, but the updated ingredient profile is just much more appealing. Genifique Ultimate is of course still quite a pricey serum, but at least we now have a really well-rounded grouping of ingredients. And to me, this comes across much more relevant in today's skincare world and also just much more modern. Because of the focus on repair within the serum, Lancome have added a few extra claims. The main change that I've seen is that they speak a lot more about improving the look of visible redness in the skin. So I guess they're looking to target some of the inflammation factors. And this of course makes sense because both beta glucan and licorice are known to have really good skin soothing ability. Overall, I think the new Genifique Ultimate is sounds super exciting and I immediately wanted to start using it. I opened it straight away. By the way, Genifique Ultimate does come with a self-loading dropper. There are a few sizes available and the 50 mil option comes with a refill component if you want to go down that road as well. Pricing, at least in Australia, is very similar to the previous Advanced Genifique. I believe there's a $10 price increase for Genifique Ultimate. <laughs> Moving on to the texture and skin feel, I left out one key difference between the serums in the previous section. Lancome have actually removed alcohol from the inky list of the updated Genifique Ultimate, and that has resulted in a fairly noticeable texture change. I'm actually a fan of alcohol in skincare ingredients. I think it does a good job of lightening the texture and allows a really good layering and application. But even without the alcohol, Lancome have managed to design this serum really nicely and it still feels quite weightless on the skin. I would say the previous Advanced Genifique formula felt a little bit more refreshing and it dried down to a bit of a silky finish. In some ways, it also had a cooling impact. The new Genifique Ultimate doesn't feel quite as fresh upon application, but it does have like a plush quality and a beautiful glide. Still very lightweight and it's still fast absorbing. So like, although the textures are different, they're not so different that I think would upset people and I know some people want to avoid alcohol so you're probably happy that it's not in there anymore. In the short time that I have been using the new Genifique Ultimate I found that my skin has felt more hydrated and even more like cushioned and plump so I actually prefer it much more over the previous serum as I noticed the effects much more immediately and just a quick note on the scent it's still quite light and pleasant very similar to the previous formula barely there as a fragrance in my opinion. <laughs> Overall, I have loved integrating the new Genifique Ultimate into my daily routine. I have been using it day and night since I got it. It's been a week and a half, two weeks. Although I haven't been using it long term, I certainly do feel like it has helped make my skin feel calmer and more balanced. And as I said before, I'm not like the biggest fan of Lancome generally, but I just can't fault this serum at all. I think it's really well designed. I look forward to using it and it integrates really well with all of my other products. And I'm keen to keep using it over the coming months. Now, whether it's worth the price, that's a little bit harder to say. If you're expecting a miracle serum, I don't think you'll find it here. This is just a super well-designed serum. It's a sensible product now with a lot of beneficial skin ingredients that I think will actually impact the skin in a positive way, especially in the long term. To me, a refined texture and packaging design and even fragrance design, all of those things matter and they actually add to the value of a product. So I'm not necessarily comparing Genifique to other cheaper, more affordable serums. I'm more looking at it in isolation. If you're already someone that buys from prestige brands, I think you'll be really happy with it. And overall, it's very well worth exploring. That's all I have for you today. A bit of an introduction video to the new Lancome Genifique Ultimate. Please do let me know if you have any questions in the comments and I'll see you in the next video.